don't do more harm to the patient. I know we all get out there and we're like, oh my God, they're trapped, we gotta get them out, stuff like that. But think about the person on the other end. They're scared, it hurts like hell. Talk to them, they are people, unless they're unconscious, but even talk to them too. They, you know, there's studies that say they still can hear you. Um, think about if you were on the end of that injury, correct. how you would want to be treated. If you would want some pain medicine before we started cutting, you know. Right. So tell the patient everything you're doing. Yeah. Um, a big part of shock with these injuries is the anxiety. But 20 minutes into cutting them out, they may start freaking out and telling you they're seeing people. Well, why? Is that because they're losing blood? Is that they have a head injury? Get a baseline and talk to them because they will change in front of you. Uh, pain management. Like we talked about yes, stuff with other things, like this stuff hurts. So like if your arm was missing, I, I would want pain medicine. So I know you guys don't do it, but let the medic or someone who's there get in there and give them something.